Hi, hello, friends, and welcome back to Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. We're supposed to hide from Filch. But I can't cast any spells. Because then he'll see me. Up on the table we go. It's really odd that... Wait, I thought I could climb up here. It's really odd that I have a memory of playing this level when... What? I was 100% sure that I could get up there because we have beans up here. I remember playing this level when um, when I was in my after school. Oh, here we go. When I was in after school, but I was definitely never this far into the game. So it must have been a demo we had or something, and I just don't remember. I just remember that this level used to scare the crap out of me. Hey, Dum Dum. Dum Dum doesn't understand a thing. I wonder if you can see me up here. And when I do, you regret it. Yeah. I'm sure I will, Filch. Bye. Let's save the game. Oh. Secret doors, huh? Ooh, that makes me wonder. There are probably some of the bookcases that I can open if I use a spell. Any secrets in here? No, I don't think so. We're moving on. Ooh. <laughs> Finally, he's whispering when he's casting spells. That's what I would do as well. <laughs> Avada Kedavra. <laughs> nice and hiding. Yeah, let's just climb up here before he gets us. There we go. I don't think he can see me up here, no matter what I do. That's how I remember it, at least, but... Could be mistaken. <laughs> what? Who hired this guy? <laughs> And when I do, you regret it. Yeah, I'm sure I will, Filch. I'm sure I will. Hmm, I don't see any secrets in here. It's usually pretty obvious if there are any. Bye, Filch. Man, he just knows all the secrets. Wonder how long he was at the how long he was at the school. I think it was mentioned something about a previous caretaker. I think Molly mentioned that there was another caretaker when they were at school. Um But I don't remember. Ooh, why is this locked? I can find a way. Good jump, Harry. Good jump. Well, I feel like I should be able to climb over over here. No, okay. Ooh! I'll catch you, and when I do, you regret it. See, he's scary as hell. No wonder small me was afraid. Wait, so how do I get up there, though? Let me, let me start by opening this door. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> how? Come out, come out wherever you are. A uh, nice trick, but I'm not coming out. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe I'm too stupid. No, that can't be it. Cause I'm a genius. Oish! I'll catch you, and when I do, you regret it. It must be in the next room that I'm doing something then. I don't I don't see what I'm doing in here. Oh, wait. <laughs> Literally just a room for that? Okay. Sure. Now, how can I get up there? Maybe you want to move. A filch is moving in on you, you idiot. We already know how to get up there. We just didn't know how to get in there. 
moron. <laughs> it's a good thing you have Hermione. <laughs> Intruder! Intruder! In the Forbidden Corridor! No, no. Oh, I want to know how I get in there. It must be through here then. Oh no. What's going on? Who was that? Someone's got past me. No, no. You're doing a great job, mate. I mean, wouldn't it be easier to just curse him from under the... From under the cloak, just a quick Petrificus Totalis, and then go about our business? Mm. Flipendo. I guess you can't Petrificus Totalis someone by using Flipendo. Now there's still this guy in here. I'm guessing I get to that by going over and in here. Move away, Filch. You have no friends. Uh, Dependa? Yes. Aha. Lumos. The Lumos. That was some secret music if I ever heard it. It was 100% meant to be though, it just... I feel like that's the most secret music we've gotten so far. Oh well. I guess not. This game is just gonna traumatize me for all future games. Running around looking for hidden... Hidden stuff. Wait. Oh, I guess that was needed, because the other doll was... Hmm. Yeah, I don't think this was open before. Okay. Uh... Okay. I understand what to do. Hup. Man, we can get up high now. Hup. 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 Can Harry jump that far? That is the... Ah, not if I can't get up on that thing now. Oh! Good catch. So that is how. Ooh. Easy now, Harry. Why does it make this weird noise? Oh, I guess it's because my cape goes off. It's still a bit odd. Um, is there any reason why I wouldn't jump down there? Because those two are clearly secrets. Let me see what's up here first. Nah, I'm jumping down. Ow. Oh, how is this thing not a secret? That is the most secrety picture I've ever seen in my life. Yep, this just takes me back. Was that it? Did I just jump down only for that? What the hell is that noise? Oh, <laughs> thought I'd miss it there, did ya? I get it, I'm hiding, so it tried to hide. But I am the Hydar. The student has become the intermediate student. 
We made it, and we even got a card. Hello, Amora. Wizards should always be whispering. No need to learn non-verbal spells if you just whisper. Or like, hide it in a cough. <laughs> that would be kind of the best though. While someone is talking, just fake a cough and you curse them. <laughs> Mara Kadabra. <laughs> I'd be the most hated wizard in dueling of all time. <laughs> oh no. That is a filch. Filch. F filch. Filth. Oh no. What? Bast Argus filch and makes a fool of him. God damn it. Oh, I can't believe I got caught by that booger. Flubber worm, stuff and fluff. Huh. 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 Okay, let's wait for him to pass then. Knew there'd be something in behind him. <laughs> He's such an idiot. Do you think I'm blind? I'm not letting anyone into that tower tonight. No, then I'll come back again tomorrow, I guess. All you had to do was stand right in the middle of this bridge and not move. Yes, I was gonna. I was gonna flip hand though it. <laughs> Oh, okay, no need. Peeves, you'll be banished for this. Oh, get the headmaster for that, that one, Peeves. If I have to distract Filch along the way. It would. <laughs> I just want to see if anything's inside of it. No. Okay. Up the tower we go. Wait, why is someone flying around? It's huh? Ron's brother Charlie had arranged to collect the dragon from the tower right. and return him to Romania. That's why I was doing it. I thought I was heading for the forbidden corridor. Alright, sure. I didn't know I was bringing Norbert, but... If I have to backtrack this entire... Oh my. <laughs> Shut up, you old fart. Wait, why didn't I stop? <laughs> what? That doesn't help me. Where is he? Pray I don't find you, my stealthy little student. What did you call me? I wish I could make that chandelier fall down, Dobby style. Come, sir. Move along. Do I just jump down here? Then I'm at the bottom of the tower? Come on now, Filch. What the hell is wrong with that cat? I could have sworn I heard footsteps in here, but... Yeah, blah. Let's check the library, my sweet. <sighs> I follow, I guess? Hello, Homora. 
Oh, he vanished. Aha! I've heard you for sure this time. Quick, Mrs. Norris. You keep watch from above. God damn it. What? Okay. <laughs> Some pretty you good jumping. Get past me now, you rotten little gutter snipes. Gutter snipes, how dare you? I felt like that would be a secret. How is the cat gonna I can kill a cat? Oh what? That was a pretty good jump. <laughs> I'm a cat now, fool. Oh Later, Mrs. Norris. Wait, I feel like there's something over there that I want. Stop, 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 stop jumping like an idiot. Why would they make this ledge if there was nothing here, though? Okay. Because <laughs> they're stupid. <laughs> Get away now, cat. Yes? Don't jump over here. I'll kill you. Come, Sha. Come away. Good cat. See, now, if he had had a golden retriever, that would have been a good god dog. Because they would have found me in a second for pets. Haha, <laughs> dum dum. How is that owl not. Okay. Intruder! <laughs> All you have to do is stand guard by the door, you idiot. Oh. But this spot is to spoon in the drawer full of knives. Man, I haven't found a secret in a while. Maybe I'm losing my edge. Maybe I am losing my edge. Where are you, you sneaky slime? I'm not gonna you, tell you. I'll catch you. Yes, I will. Hmm. Can I knock something? Oh, yes. Oh. Wait, Sir Nicholas wouldn't. Sure, Hello he would. Again, Harry. Oh, <laughs> he can see me. Rip. How's the bean collecting? Friend George are up to their usual tricks, I presume. I heard about your Quidditch victory. Yes, well done, Harry. On to the cuppy, what? What? <laughs> you just compromised this entire operation. Ooh, three beans. What a secret. <laughs> I got 549, Jesus Christ. I hope they translate into points at the end of the year. Slytherin would be left in the dust. All right. All right, Sir Nicholas. Do not give me away. Can I jump that far? I can jump that far. Couldn't jump that far. Sometimes Harry just jumps ridiculously high. I don't think I can jump that far. This far, however. Huh. Oh, fuck. We're okay. Good job, Harry. Huh. Wow. How am I supposed to get over there then? Because that one is higher. But further, hmm. What? I'll just follow Nicholas. <laughs> oh, he's just helping me. The ghost of Gryffindor, eh? Oh, we're back here. Go away, Mrs. Norris. No! What? What? No! What? Really? What? I thought she'd just alert? No. Ah. There are no intruders. Just get the freaking cat away from me. Uh. 
Where is that cat gonna jump? Who was that? Someone's got past. Ah, we're fine. We're super not fine. Huh. I know that there's a secret back here. Haha, -ha, cause I saw it from the other side. And we need more beans. Nice. Nice. This this is how Harry is gonna make all his money. Bean pusher. What's wrong with him? I'm not a slime. Nothing that way either? Man. There's really not a lot of secrets in the whole library, huh? And out we go. Ooh, the mirror of desire. Wow. <laughs> that was that cutscene. Oh, wow. It's a secret. There's a secret behind it. Oh. Reflected in the mirror of Erised were Harry's parents, James and Lily Potter. Harry stared hungrily back as though hoping to fall right through the glass and reach them. He was startled when a voice sounded behind him. Harry turned slowly about. Are you watching so my 3D movie? My before you have discovered the delights of the mirror of Erised, said Professor Dumbledore. He went on to explain that the mirror showed nothing more or nothing less than the deepest, most desperate desire of our hearts. But that it would give neither knowledge nor truth. The mirror of Erised will be moved to a new home shortly, Dumbledore went on, adding ominously that if Harry ever came across it again, he would be prepared. But prepared for what? thought Harry. <laughs> what? Filthy whelps gave us the slip, Mrs. Norris. I've locked the only door out of here for the sake of me nerves. Stay here and watch the library for a bit, my dear. Hmm. I mean, there was a safe book behind his little thingamajig. Aloha, Mora. Uh, gee, I wonder where I'm going. Could this be it? We'll save it book. That's a secret. Yes, we're back in business. Boop. We climb. This is a big ass library. Oh. Only way out of this room is past that gate. It makes an awful racket. You take that side of the room, and I'll take this one. We'll you catch you, Mrs. Norris. Do you think that thing in the background is a secret? Intruder! <laughs> What's that? <laughs> right? You, and when I do, you regret it. That looks. Hmm. There's something down below as well. What happens if I fall uh. down though? Can I? I must be able to get back up. Uh. Yes, yes. There's stuff all over this place. This is nothing. Alright. I thought it might have beans inside. I don't care about the rest. God, you're Leviosa. <laughs> what? Who blocks a door with weights? Oh no. That's right. Cats fear dogs. Got three golden retriever girls who would. Scare the bejeebus out of you. Yep. <laughs> you can't run after me while I'm on a cutscene. That's not fair. Hey, Tom Tom. 
You don't see a thing. That didn't work at all. Okay. Oh, come on, the same on both sides? Alright. Alright then. Abracadabra. <laughs> Flipendo is so inconsistent, whatever. Yeah, see, now he's smart. All you have to do is stand right in front of the door. See, now I'm screwed. Thanks, peeps. That was one of my favorite parts about everything, where McGonagall told peeps to give him hell. Uh, I can't remember when that was. Oh no, she's still sitting there. I think... Wait, now... Hmm, can I get back up there? I don't think I can. I just wanted to see if there was a secret up there or something. By jumping all the way to the end. Oh well. So McGonagall that told Peeves? I can't remember if it was... Um, no, no, no. Give him help. No, was it friend George that says give him hell from us? I think McGonagall told Peeves to do it as well against Umbridge. No, she gave him back, like, something. No, she said it unscrews the other way. Friend George said give him hell, Peeves, when, uh, when they left the school. That's how it went. That's how it went. It unscrews. What are they doing? Oh, I get to see what they're doing with the beams now! Oh, 15 seconds left of my camera recording. Thanks, EU laws of video cameras. This is a good a uh, time as any to end the episode anyway. We just got to Fred and George a secret lair. Hope this is everything you want it to be, and I'll see you around tomorrow for another episode. Bye friends.